So how to use the production from the tile you're putting the District of Wonder on? For example, here we have a nice little tile with woods on it. A pretty good spot for a campus. Now, I can't put a campus there right now because it'll destroy the woods and I'm not gonna get any production out of it. Well, right now I'm building a settler. What you can do is go to the queue and get rid of the settler. Throw him in the garbage. Whatever production you put into there, still there. It didn't go anywhere. What you can do now, though, is chop. With this chop and Magnus in the city, it will bring you 54 production. Now, we're not going to be able to see it right away, but campus right now is going to take seven turns. Oracle, 19. So let's see what happens when we chop. Campus goes to three turns. And the Oracle goes to 16. Shave three turns off. Now, obviously, if you want to build an oracle, you should have a carve policy in place for another 15%. Even better, obviously, if you have autocracy for another 10%. But in this case, we're not doing it. We're going to go with the campus. As you can see, the production on it is 0 of 97, but it's only three turns to go. The production will show the next turn. 69 production i mean granted the city itself is producing 15 so whatever the difference is is being applied hopefully you find this tip valuable please like and subscribe and comment comment if you have any other tips when it comes to the beautiful game of civ